Hey you guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are not new, but if you are new, hey girl, hey. I am so excited because this is going to be my moving vlog series video two. I just got the keys today and I already kind of moved some stuff in, but I wanted to give you guys a somewhat empty apartment tour before I really start, you know, like deep cleaning everything and situating into the new space so yes but before we get started if this is your first time here welcome if you like videos like this or you just like faith talks if you're interested in just seeing what a girl in her 20s is up to please make sure you hit the subscribe button down below and like this video and also comment where is your favorite place to shop for home decor my favorite place is home goods and home scents for sure but leave it down below in the comments because I would like to, you know, try new places out for home decor and figure out what my style is a little bit. Let's get to this empty apartment tour. Okay, so we're starting here at my door, period. Um, I'll turn the camera around. So this is the front door. And then if you turn to the left, you just have this wall. I plan on putting like a mirror right here and having hooks as well. And then if you come over here, this is the bathroom. Let me turn on the light. This is the bathroom. It's super cute. Um, and it's pretty spacious, especially for the kind of apartment I'm in. I'm somewhat in a studio apartment. Technically, I am. But you'll just see why I said technically. But this is the bathroom. It has a nice vanity space area, a lot of vanity space. Um, yes and this big big mirror the lighting is like white lighting so it's like really good for videos as you guys can see um and then just got storage space down here super nice and then i have three drawers um and soft clothes i love the soft clothes and then toilet standard toilet and then this is the shower um and then we have the towel racks. I have two towel racks back here. And then I have one little hook right there. But this is the entirety of the bathroom. Alrighty guys, so now that we're back in the hall, starting back at the front door, I'm gonna show you guys what is to the right. Um, to the right is just the utilities, um, like the water heater and everything, so that's locked. And then right here at this door, these two double doors, is the washer and dryer, which I'm so excited that I was able to get find a unit with both a washer and dryer, because um, I know that that normally doesn't happen for people, especially when they're getting their first apartment. Um, but anyway, and then I have like this little area over here where I could like store all of my laundry Necessities I can also store like my broom and things like that And then they also have this shelf which I am definitely excited about because it'll allow me to you know organize a little bit more but that's That closet and then if you turn you see you see Ashlyn No, <laughs> You're fine you see the entirety of the apartment. Like I said, I did kind of start bringing stuff in, so please do not mind the bags on the floor. But um, if you turn this way, the bags are in the front, but in here is just a closet. And here's just a coat closet, I guess you can call it, but I don't really wear a lot of coats, which is crazy. But, um, so I might just use this for more like closet, like actual closet space. Um, and more storage, of course, because I don't have a lot of storage space in this unit, unfortunately. But I'm definitely going to make do with what I have. And then if you turn, you see the kitchen area. This is the kitchen. Right here is the lovely fridge. Um, it's a standard fridge and freezer. Type of situation i like the freezer i'm so happy that i have an ice maker because i'm definitely gonna miss that being at home having like my own having my own um like water dispenser and ice dispenser but as long as i have an ice maker i guess i'll be fine and then we have cabinets up top here 
I'm probably never going to use these cabinets because I don't, as you see, I can't reach. Um, and then I have this cabinet. <laughs> um, Sorry, guys. <laughs> so I have this cabinet here. They didn't fix it, but it's whatever. And then I have these drawers. Um, like I said, again, soft clothes. We love a soft clothes moment. And then if you come over here, don't mind the mess on the stove, but this is a stove and oven. I like that it is electric. A lot of people prefer to have gas, but me personally, I like electric. They're, they are a little bit harder to clean, but I don't cook, so that's not a problem. And then we have uh, the microwave. This was something that was definitely a necessity for me because I, I shop at Trader Joe's. And a lot of the stuff I get from Trader Joe's require me to have a microwave. And as you guys can see also, I don't have a lot of countertop space. So I was super happy to see that they had the built-in microwave here. And as you see, I have two more cabinets up there that I, I again, probably will not use because I can't reach it. And then we have these two cabinets, um, which is where I'll store like my plates and things like that. Um, and then my favorite part of the kitchen, I have the sink. This sink is so nice, you guys. I love how big and deep it is. And it's, I'm weird. I like stuff like this. So I absolutely love this sink. Um, and as you guys can see, I already kind of put my little soap. And then we have more countertop space. I'm super excited to have a dishwasher too. I always had a dishwasher when I was growing up, so. And then we have some more cabinets right here, which again, I love. It's just. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to make sure I was getting the angle. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> These two cabinets right here, which I love more cabinet and storage space. I, it's just me, so I like that I have a lot of cabinet space in the kitchen. I may utilize some of the cabinet space for extra storage that's not like kitchen related. This is my living space. I'm so excited. It's very small, but it's perfect for me. Um, so over this way is where I plan to put like my dining um, table, like dining area. I do plan on putting my TV up on this wall, um, but we'll see how that goes. And then if you go here, you'll see a wall of windows. And if you know me, you know I love natural lighting. So this was perfect for me. And it also gives me a really nice view of the courtyard at my um, building, which is nice. And then over here, you have the rest of the space. Um, this is where I plan on putting my couch against this wall. I have plenty of ideas for how I want this space to be, but it's all contingent on the kind of couch that I get. So we'll definitely, I'll take you guys along for that process because um, I don't have any furniture that's gonna go in here other than the dining table over there. And then what does MTV Crib say? Let me show you where the magic happens. Ain't no magic happening, just me guys. <laughs> this is my bedroom. As you guys can see, it is carpeted in here. Everywhere else was hardwood or laminate, I guess you could say. But this is my tiny little bedroom. Um, it is a little bit smaller than the room I have now at home, but I'm gonna make it work because it's my own space. This is the closet. The closet is not that big, but luckily I'm not one that hangs my clothes up. And I'll say it again real loud. I don't hang my clothes up, I just don't. I fold my clothes, <laughs> so I plan to utilize this closet space, have like a dresser, um on both sides like have an area for shoes maybe because i have a bigger closet i'll try to hang my clothes up i'll give it a little try um and then it's just these two sliding doors which i love um i do i am gonna miss having like an actual door that opens that's what i have at my place now but sliding doors just takes me back to when i was younger so why not Alrighty guys, that is the entirety of my empty apartment tour video. Like I said, I do live in a studio kind of situation because my bedroom does not have a door. Um, and this unit is, I think, 500, almost 600 square feet. So it's a good size, especially for one person. But I'm just super excited to get into decorating the space and making this unit, this apartment, my home. It still doesn't feel real to me. Um, my friend will tell you, she's behind the camera. 
Oh. <laughs> um, <laughs> this doesn't feel real to know that I like thought about this moment for so long, so many years, prayed about it, and you know, just trusted God, wanting to move earlier than what I should have, and just, you know, it just feels crazy that it's actually happening. I still don't, it hasn't hit me yet. Maybe it'll hit me once I get more things in here and whatever, but thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked this video, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and make sure you leave your comment down below what stores you like to shop at for Home Essentials because I would love to know what stores y'all like to go to. But yes, until next time, see you. Been stressed for so long, so stuck in my own way. So I'll enjoy this moment. It's the day that the Lord has